Hi guys, I'm back. Had a day off, did a lot of stuff, so here we go. This is the um, the pearl colored paint. And as you can see, there are some uh, pretty nice hues of color. But, you know, I, I was expecting more. So we'll just have to see uh, how that turns out. If I do something with a brush and very thinned out pearl colors on it, I'm going to do that in a bit. Not on video because that takes way too long. But it does have some nice effects, right? So put that one aside. Then to the big one that I did. This is the big one. And it also has uh, some nice effects. Totally covered. Lots of cells. And it's pretty big. It is, uh, it worked out nicely. Even though it is a little zigzaggy because I didn't have enough paint and I had to tilt the canvas too much. It still has a lot of cells in it, so that's okay. Um, I'm going to be um, pasting a couple of videos together because there are some things I want to show you guys. So I'm going to stop this one now and then stick it together. I'm going to take you downstairs and show you my computer. So be back in a flash. Okay guys, this is my um, my computer screen. This is my YouTube channel. You see here, you see the videos. And you see all my videos like that. Then up here, it says uh, community. So I'll go to community. Here are your comments. Then you go up here and it says spam. 760 messages in spam so I click on that and there's nothing see try it and try it they can't you can't see anything so there are 760 messages in my spam folder which I can't get out so there we go if I click on this one this is the uh, publicized uh, comments See, there you are. But there are just 760 messages up there. So clicking on it again. And there's nothing. I can't get you, out. I can get you guys out. So I'm sorry if you're stuck in there. And I can't read them. And I can't comment on them. Because, well, you're just stuck in my spam folder. And YouTube won't get you guys out. I, um, you know, when you do this, the help and feedback right here, down here. Let's see. Where's my little mousy poo? There we are. Help and feedback. Okay, so I'm saying uh, feedback. Then I get this thing. Then you click on here. And then I say, let's see, here. I'm going to send them this, say OK, I'm ready, then I'm going to say, wait a minute because I have to hold the uh, iPad a little bit differently, uh, help me get the spam messages oops of the spam box please okay so I send it here sending it well, I hope they do something because it's driving me crazy that I can't, I can't, you know, 
see what's in there and I can't answer you guys. So just to show you that I really want to comment on all questions, but sometimes you get stuck in there. I can't get you out. So, oh, this is my dog standing on the table, little nooky, because my husband just drove off with, <laughs> with the car. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yes, my dog is always standing on the table. Ah, you know why? She, she did that the first day we got her from Spain. And I just can't, I can't punish her for doing that. So I took all the vases off the table and I just thought, well, okay, just let her do that. I, I can't help it. That's the kind of dog I have. And, um, oh, I can show you one of my other lamps I made. That one I made too. Oh, and that, that German Shepherd you're seeing there. That was my former dog, and then there's another black dog, that's Sander, he died too, but he was really old. <coughs> and then, Nuki, Nidu, baby. Then behind that is my cockatoo, Coco. Yeah, she died too. She was 35 years old, died of a heart attack. And that's my lamp, another one. And that is a cool, cool barometer. Okay, guys, I'm going I'm to stop because I'm showing you guys all my house. So I'm going to stop and uh, go upstairs, mix some paint, and do a pretty pouring. See you later. Hello, guys. So I'm back, and uh, we're going to do the pour. But before we do that, I want to do the last update on the sponsors of April 2017. So this is the, the list, and... Um, these people are going to be in the drawing of April for the uh, 40 by 40. Uh, let me get one. So it's going to be either this one, which is already um, varnished. Uh, this already has three or four coats of varnish on it. It's pretty big. It's a 40 by 40. Put it up close a bit. Show you all. It has some metallic in it. That middle bit is metallic. Or it's going to be this one. And the person that wins can choose which one they like. Because it's uh, both the same uh, postage. So it doesn't matter. So I like them both, and um, the person that wins can choose this nice and calm one or this little more dramatic one. So they're both 40 by 40, so that's, um, that's good. 40 centimeters by 40 centimeters, not 40 inches, because that would be really big. So... Uh, Thank you all, all my sponsors for April, and um, I really appreciate it. I love you all. I love all my viewers, though, but <laughs> I just want to thank you. So, thank you all. What are we going to do? I just did two sm uh, short videos. I showed you the dry pieces, the big one, and the, um, the pearl colors. And I showed you my spam folder with over 700 comments stuck in the spam folder. So if I don't answer, you're probably stuck in there somewhere. And then I have, uh, oh, I showed you uh, my dog who always stands on the table in the living room. Well, okay. I know, I know that isn't, you know, <laughs> what you're supposed to do, but she has had such a bad life in Spain. I just don't, I don't punish her and I normally, I, I would never even need to punish her because she's such a good dog and um, I just can't do it. I know, I'm a softy, but that's the only thing she does. When uh, when my husband dry goes away, he, he does the grocery shopping mostly, that's when she goes up on the table and usually she, she sits there waiting for him to get back and I just don't want to do that, you know discipline her to get off that table who cares we don't eat there we eat in the kitchen so 
Okay, <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, the colors we're gonna do today is uh, something pretty ni pretty nice. We're gonna do this color, red. Then we're gonna do this color, orange. Then we're gonna do this color, yellow. Doesn't that look exciting? Yes, it does. And then we're gonna do this color, the blue. And um, I think that's gonna be really fun to do. So I've already mixed it all up. This time it's um, all acrylics from Amsterdam Acrylics. Uh, the Azo Yellow Deep, the Azo Orange, uh, oh, the red I don't know. Uh, this red, it's, uh, oops, sorry, 315, it's Paoli Red, I don't know, pa Pirole Red, yeah, that's it, so that's the red, and then this one is the turquoise blue, not the turquoise green that I always use, so I'm getting some of my gloves on. Oh, and there's some more exciting news. Like um, a while back, I got um, I got a message from the um, the Netherlands import people from Uva Troll, the flu troll. And then you know, um, I talked to the to the. He left his uh, phone number, so I called him back. And then he discussed about you know he wanted to see if we could get together discuss some sort of a sponsor deal and blah 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 so I was pretty excited about that then he said you know I'll call you back in a week and we'll see what we can um, you know make an appointment and uh, we'll do that so I waited a week waited two weeks who called not the importer of Uber Troll so I thought too bad I don't care you know, I went with went through so much with that Royal Towns that I thought, you know, I don't care anymore. I'm just making art because I love it. I got all my sponsors and people who enjoy watching my videos. So that's cool. Then this morning I get a mail from Royal Talents. If I would consider contacting them. And I wrote them an email. I sent them my uh, telephone number. I said, you know... Um, I think it's probably best if you call me because, you know, when you, um, when you write, there's no intonation in the, in the words and sometimes they come across a little bit, uh, a little bit funny, not the way you mean them. So she called me right away and, um, I have an appointment to visit Royal Talons on the 11th of May. It's on a Thursday. And I'll keep you guys up to date about what happens there. So that's pretty exciting. Okay, now let's get on with the pour. I gotta get a cup. Gotta drink my juice. So the pour is gonna be these four. And then I'm gonna have some um, paint left over because uh, I made just a little bit more and I hope it doesn't go all muddy or something like that because I didn't check just put this one in the middle like that and I'm just gonna put some paint in here and hope for the best that red and blue is certainly gonna do something I'm pretty sure about that Ooh, it is a bit thick I thought I had it pretty thin, but it is a bit thick. A little bit more orange and a little bit more blue. Okay, so we got it all in there and I think I will give it a little stir just like that. And I'm gonna do a flip it, flip it, cup it. There we go. And remember people, I just saw another video of someone doing a flip cup. They just picked up the cup and, and they ruined the pour. Just totally ruined it. And I'm thinking, don't you see what you're doing? Don't do that. So pull it back like that. And just let the cup 
slowly empty. You can put that along the side like this, but never let it drip in there because look at that. That's just too pretty to put all the drips in. So, who was expecting this? Not me, I can tell you that. That much red in there, I wasn't expecting that. Okay, now if you're thinking why is she doing that with the torch, go back to the instruction video. That's where I explain it all. Help it a little bit over the sides there. Then down this way, just a little bit. Not too much. Down here. And I'm gonna do something to this because my I'm just my hands are itching to do something different. So I'm letting it over the side, that's about it. That's covered, that corner is covered, this one is covered, and that one's covered. What do you guys think? Is it cool or is it cool? I think it's cool. So I have the push pins on the bottom. And I'm pretty sure this is going to work a little bit more, so I'm going to keep you guys uh, on here. Just going to give it a little torch. Just like that. And I can already see that um, here in the middle, the red is coming through more. So it's, there's more definition in the cells of the red ones. I'll, I'll put you up close in a bit, but I just want to let it work a little. And I can see that there are almost no bubbles. What I would like is a little bit more blue on there. Like that. That's good. And what I might do... But then you guys would like to see that, I bet. Just take this and this. Let me let me try this. I'm not sure if this is gonna work. Give it a little swirl. Nah, that's not gonna work. I was gonna put like something over here. No, nope, I'm not gonna do it because that's gonna ruin the piece. I kind of like what it's doing there. Maybe just a little bit more blue. Just a little bit more. That was nice. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> There's another thing I wanted to discuss with you guys. And that is... Um, There's a channel... And it's um, a man named uh, Danny Clark, and he, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get it in, on my phone. Wait a minute. So he mentioned my name uh, yesterday, and um, he has, you know, I've I've been watching his videos, but he does it more scientific on the scientific side. So he weighs a lot of stuff and he shows you um, why he does something, you know, more in depth. So let me get that on my uh, telephone, YouTube, and then uh, Danny Clark. Let me see. That's it. Sue, so, where are you? Where's your, there you are. It's this one, Danny Clark. Can you see it? He has these really cool little um, screen savers. You know, the intro. They're almost all, um, 
all the same with the with his initials there so if you have uh, uh, some spare time and I didn't upload something and you're thinking here I'm sitting with my coffee and I got nothing to look at go over to um, YouTube and please uh, subscribe to his channel because he's such a nice guy he really is and uh, I would really like it if some of my um, subscribers went over and subscribed to his channel uh, he does some pretty amazing stuff and he does some resin too which I don't do and uh, because a lot of people have been asking me to do resin and um, well I just don't so here's one of his resins and he does some with his daughter that is so cute Yuki. Okay, so what we're going to do first is I'm going to mix up this resin. Okay. That's okay. cute, isn't that okay, cute? How many colors? Oh, come uh, on. We have one, two, three, four, five. Right, and what colors do we have? We have um, teal. All right. <laughs> that is That's too cute. cute. So, guys, if you want to, you, if you want to see something different than uh, my uh, videos all the time. Pop over to uh, Danny Clark and uh, subscribe and watch his videos. He uh, has a couple of videos. so um, And he's working on his channel. So he'll be getting there up to, I don't know, 200. <laughs> I think I have. Yeah, I make too many videos. I bore you people to death. So it has changed just a little bit. Not that much. And I'll take you guys down so I'll show you a close-up. I have to put my stabilizing thing uh, away. There we go. So let's get the glare out. There we are. But those are pretty colors, aren't they? I, I really think so. I think they're very, very pretty together, especially when, when you get a lot of blue. I'll be working on this one uh, a little more. Not this painting, but more on the colors. So there's a lot of lacing going on there. A lot of cells. It's uh, kind of pretty. Going over the sides. There we go. Show you the other side. Where are you? There you are. So it's, um, I think it's a keeper. I want to keep this one. Well, not keep it, keep it, but, you know, sell it. So I think this one uh, is sellable. Okay guys, so you got all the news that's what's been happening to me lately and um, I will uh, put this up on YouTube and I will see you guys in the next video. In the meantime, make some beautiful art. Bye bye.